In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make an OP Mage class early game in Elden Ring. The first thing you want to do is select the Astrologer class and select the Golden Seed. Once that's done, you want to use three of these touch grace points and then you'll finally get your steed and that's going to make it a lot easier to do the rest of this video. The next part of the video is me showing you how to get the first two map locations. If you want the full tutorial on that, I have done a video on that and I'll link it in the description. Now you want to head over to this location and follow where I go into the building and this is going to get us the Meteor Staff, the first staff we'll be using and be using for a long time in early game. I've just cleared out all of the enemies there, there's a few more enemies. So yeah, you kill these enemies here and as you can see the items in front of me, pick that up and we'll have the Meteorite Staff. Now that's done, you want to head down these stairs, which is just around the corner from the building we was just done. Open up the door, head towards the chest on the right hand side, and we get Rock Sling. This spell is super OP, and I'm going to show you now what type of damage it does against random players. Before we do that, basically you want to focus on intelligence, mind, and vigor. Those are the three main attribute points you want to be ranking up throughout the early game. Now I'm going to show you how good Roxling is with the Meteorite Star. We're now going to head over to the lake and grab a sword for this build. If you use this height here, you can take out one of the giants and it makes the rest of it really easy. The cart will stop 
There is a lot of lot of enemies there, so you just want to wipe out as many as you can, drag them all away, and then run back there. And then you can pick up the Carrion Knight Sword. And again, after this clip now, I'm going to show you how powerful that actually is. The next step is going to the Eastern Table Land and you want to fight both sets of Fire Monks to get the Fire Robes outfit. You want to do both locations to make sure you get all of the parts. I've done this about 50 plus times and had a mixture of spawns, they were completely random so just do both and then reset your grace point and go again and again and again until you get this. It does take some time but it is well worth it.
Now you want to head to the round table hold. You speak to this person as soon as you spawn in. And you buy the catch flame. Once that's done, you want to head over to the twin maidens and buy the finger seal. What do you say? That is a work of heresy. It's incantation. Very well. And then after that, I'm going to show you how powerful this incantation is. I hope this video has helped. There will be more videos down the line like this. So if you did like it, make sure you leave a like, comment and subscribe.